I'm going to talk about fruitcakes. We had a lady on last night, I think her name was Gladys uh, Farrick from Texas, who made fruitcakes. We have made a lot of jokes. Did you ever get a fruitcake for Christmas? Always. I got one this Christmas. Do you eat it? No. See, that's the damn. That's the damn the same. Yeah. Nobody eats them. You keep it for a long time. You, you put it up in the closet somewhere, yeah. and then you wait till next Christmas, and you to so somebody else. else. Uh, and they weigh a ton. They're very heavy. All right, let me show you just. Now, here is a small one. What would you think? Here's a fruitcake. It's a country fair called fruitcake. What would you think this way? This weighs, it's only a small box. Several pounds? It weighs about two pounds. Wow. And we wanted to see if we could cut it upstairs. Right. We were unable to cut it. So what we did, <laughs> we sent a fruitcake, another fruitcake, you know, one of the regular round ones, and we sent it down. Well, here, let me give you the ingredients in here. Pecans, business cherries, almonds or almonds, what do you say? Almonds. Almonds, eggs, flour, sugar, fruit juice, candy, lemon peel, rum or whiskey, baking yeah. powder. What? I say, yeah. Now you know that, huh? <laughs> baking powder, honey, and salt. Now, those are fairly light ingredients. Right. What happens when you put them together that makes it so, so heavy. damn heavy? Yeah. Well, we thought perhaps there's some secret ingredient to account for this, and, but we couldn't get it open. So what we did, we sent a large fruitcake that we've had up in the office to Carter. Is it Carter Friley? Yes. Carter Friley Demolition. Yeah. Hey? <laughs> In Ashland, Kentucky, and we told them, we told them to open the fruitcake, cut it open in any way they could, and film it and send us the film. Watch the monitor. Here's what they sent us. There's your fruitcake. <laughs> really, is a carbon steel chains to the back of a pickup. This was there. This was. And <laughs> all right, here we are. Well, they took it out on the railroad here. All right, here we go. The National Karate na <laughs> National Karate. This guy is a mad grand master. <laughs> So we took it back there. These guys are still... All right. Now look at this machine. This thing can rip a car apart. These are the things they use to demolish cars, right? <laughs> this is one of those machines they actually use to take cars right. apart before they... All right. This exerts about eight tons of pressure. Nothing. Absolutely. <laughs> Perfect condition. Nothing. Didn't even put a dent in it. Right. <laughs> and here we are. These guys are still at it again. Nothing. All right. All right. Here comes the Amtrak 715, which would make it about 1130. <laughs> Now, this ought to do it. No. <laughs> oh. Perfect condition. All right. You guys have been out there all day. Dynamite. There's three sticks of dynamite. We tried everything, but I guess now we have to, uh, let's see, uh, take a look at it. Perfect. Perfect condition. Well, I'm afraid it's time after this. We've done everything here. These guys are still at it late at night. Time to unleash the awesome power of the atom.
may never know. We did our best. We may never know what's inside a fruitcake, but however, we did find one good use for your fruitcake. Watch this well-known commercial and you'll use for a fruitcake. Would you like more coffee? Oh, yes, that's wonderful. It's Morning Symphony. And is still going. Not anymore. <laughs> Finally, we did it. <laughs> Finally, we found. We'll be right back. Stay where you are. Caesar. <laughs>